hey there the name is denzel welcome to another video if you are new here do well to hit the subscribe button join the family if you are coming back to see another one of my videos i'd like to thank you for coming back and if you haven't already do well to hit that subscribe button support for this channel and help us grow to the heights we know we can achieve all right so in today's tutorial i'm going to be showing you how to make two-sided materials all right this can apply for things like money or cards like on the thumbnail so you need to it can be very helpful you know if you don't want to extrude a new face out and make the mesh uh, have any thickness at all you want it to be completely flat you can do this for money like the two-sided faces of a dollar bill all right so without any further ado let's hop into this tutorial and do this real quick real simple no time to waste two-sided materials let's go all right first things first let's create a new scene i have deleted everything by default already so let's shift a and add a plane let's hop over to the shading tab where all the magic is about to happen all right now we're going to ink we are going to allow this place to take up all the space we hit control space bar where we hit new material let's go ahead and move this down and let's hit shift and let's have shift s to switch this and let's go to shaders and add a diffuse shader all right let me make this red now let's press shift d and duplicate this and holding control shift drag and i think right mouse drag right mouse click drag you have mix all right this will only work if you have the node wrangler add-on enabled i've said it in a lot of my videos this is very helpful so if you don't just go into edit preferences add-ons and search node wrangler all right activate that add-on to help you in every single thing all right let's hit shift a and let's go to let's hit s to search and let's search geometry all right there is the geometry node i want to take the back facing over here and plug that into the factor all right back facing over here and plug that into the factor let's change this red to something clear like blue now let's hit control space bar to leave here and this will just apply and as you can see the top is blue the bottom is red this will work for textures as well just make sure you hit just make sure that everything leads to the shaders that lead to this mix shade all right so if you want to apply a texture you just plug the texture into the color anything can work here but make sure you have this guy plugged in here to ensure that the front and the back are completely different colors even if it is the same face all right let me go into edit mode and show you the same face all right i hope this tutorial has been helpful guys it is really quick really simple i wanted i wanted to keep it short for you guys so if you apply this technique just give me a shout out on instagram i am at king underscore denzel for 3d that is at k-i-n-g underscore d-e-n-z-e-l dot 3d all right have a nice one guys keep watching this video subscribe if you haven't already and come back anytime i'll be here for you peace